everybody, it's old Shaziz here, I'm out here in my mad science laboratory. I'm going to be doing a, uh, a low pressure uh, helium test on the plasma reactor. This uh, balloon right here is pressurized with helium, which is feeding into the uh, plasma reactor itself. And what I'm hoping to figure out from this particular test is whether or not the field strength is any better than it was before. So with that said, I'm going to fire this thing up right here. Let me see here. Well, so far you can see the uh, field strength pretty good. around that balloon right there. And that's low pressure helium. The uh, original uh, concept is to use argon gas because it's from my experience, experience <coughs> But the argon seems to conduct better as far as electricity goes. Holy moly. Yeah, that's nice. Okay, let me kill some lights here. You can't see very well inside there on the camera it looks like. But uh, helium puts off an orange color as opposed to argon, which is like that purple color you see back in there. The longer you run this thing, the stronger it seems to get. Smell the ozone up in here, boy. Notice the uh, field extends over there, disrupting the monitors. Let's uh, kick that off there for a second. Yep. I have noticed, I'll have to turn some lights on here for a second. This is quite unique. I haven't figured this out yet or not. Watch this. Huh. I don't know if you can see that or not on that monitor. Let me see if I can get that. This is very interesting stuff.
Well, I don't think you can see that, but on that particular monitor, those monitors there, my hand appears to be kind of transparent. Ah. Look up in front of the uh... Okay. I highly doubt that picked up very good. I'm going to have to uh, get a recording off of that. Anyway, back to uh, the plasma reactor here. Let's see if I can get this camera down up in there. I don't know if you can see that in there or not. That's one side. The signal tester is picking up real well. Field playing hell on the camera, that's for sure. Good lord, man. Yeah, the uh, longer you leave it running, the stronger the field gets. I can't wait to get the argon in there in the main chamber. Sorry about the camera going screwy, folks. But that uh, field's pretty strong and it's acting funny with the camera. Lord man. Well, I was in hopes to get you a better better view of the back half. I can't seem to get around the back half of it without getting too close because I'm right in the middle of the field. And I sure as heck ain't about to stick my finger on there to scoot it over. Oh, man. Good <laughs> Lord. Yeah, that's, uh, like I said, that's a low-pressure helium test. And you can see I've gotten quite a ways away from it. And we're still, uh, we're still transmitting. The longer it uh, stays running, the, the stronger the field gets. Let me turn some, some more lights off here for a second. Trying to get a better view of the plasma itself. Ah, uh. uh, you can't see it. It's really low pressure and it hasn't been vacuumed out yet, so it's got a little bit of atmosphere in there with the uh, with the helium. 
and the reason why I ended up using helium is because it was the only thing I could get a hold of at the time without having to buy a, uh, a brand new tank to exchange for the tank whenever I get the helium this is uh, several hundred bucks total tried ordering uh, argon from overseas but they wouldn't deliver it to the United States anyway I don't know if you can see that very well this is, uh, this is the receiver down here Arr. it's charging up real well that one there is charging up you see the yellow light on there alrighty then whoo man that is a strong feel brother but so far so good doing exactly what I wanted it to do. Let's, uh, that strange few, few strange things going on. Ah, it's not cutting out now. You can obviously see that field's gotten stronger. Alright, well. Helium don't do too bad. The uh, original deal was to use argon. I wish you could see the uh, orange color in there. It's just a really light orange color but uh, it's not vacuumed out and it's under really low pressure the only pressure is that uh, that balloon right there and okay just so that you know that that is helium inside there I'll shut this valve off Some folks uh, like to breathe in helium and talk like uh, Mickey Mouse, but uh, I'm not thinking that's a really good idea. <laughs> All right, that is helium. <laughs> Yay! Fun with helium. <laughs> ah! Now it's like going clear across the daggone roof up there. That's crazy. It'll probably blow up in the middle of the night or something. <laughs> Alright everybody, um, I'm still out here in my mad science laboratory running tests uh, on the plasma reactor. Been uh, spent a lot of hours on it and uh, like, I said, like I said that was a uh, low pressure helium test and uh, seemed to be uh, doing exactly what I expected it to do as far as uh, the field strength and all that so whenever I get uh, the actual argon in here and we get this thing situated right should be a little bit more of an exciting show however uh, like I said all I had was uh, helium <laughs> All in the name of science. <laughs> but uh, yeah. <coughs> oh, jeez. Alrighty then. What you're looking at right there is a gas filled Tesla coil. Plasma reactor. <coughs> Should have a tiny bit of helium left in there. So I shut that valve off but uh, yeah you, you don't want to stick your fingers on that thing because let me uh, kill some light <coughs> 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 
<coughs> Excuse me. <sighs> Listen to that puppy hum, man. Ah. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, she's a uh, She's definitely hot, and you can't hold this uh, bulb on here even though it's a fluorescent bulb too long because uh, it gets really super hot up in there. And you can smell the ozone thick in here, people. Alrighty then. Alright, well... That's about it for now. Woo! Smell like ozone. Smells good. <laughs> Peace and love, everybody. Stay tuned. Hopefully, I'll get this thing up and running a lot quicker um, now that I uh, I got some uh, connections for some argon gas. So, peace and love, everybody. Take care.